everybody today i'm super excited to share this video with you guys because today is um a video about birthday haul so yes my birthday did actually pass so yeah um but i i didn't have time to film this so now i am and yeah my birthday passed but it's still gonna be exciting because I have lots of presents and in total I think I have 21 I'll count them again but um yeah some are just like a little stuff so they're not all um big toys or presents some are like homemade and stuff like that so yeah let's get on to the video so the first present is okay so the first present is very exciting so you can see it is a Mustang mare, and I'm gonna tell all the stuff about it. So, who gave this to me is my very best friend, Chloe. She was in my birthday party, and um, yeah, she's also my like filming partner. Um, so, we filmed together a lot. Anyway, thank you so much for this Schleich Mustang mare. And I named her Bella, and I love her so much. She's super cute. And I think she, I believe she has a foal, but like a Mustang foal, I'm not sure. This came with the, the other barn, it, it came with the Shalike barn, so there's two types of barn, but um, yeah, anyway, she came with one of the barns, I think. So yeah, she's very cute, and now next, let's um, get on to the next present. And again... My friend Chloe bought this Bengal cat for me. She's adorable. So yes, she knows I am obsessed with cats. So is she. I love cats so much. Not to brag, but I know a lot of a lot of facts about cats because I just I love it so much. I love cats so much. So yeah, and my favorite breed of all time is the Bengal cat. So you might think she's a leopard, but not. Her name is Spots. She's the barn cat. So yeah, she's very cute. Thank you so much again, Chloe, for this so cute Bengal cat. Next, we have a lot. So she made 15 stuff for me, like exactly 15. And it's Chloe again. And she made all of this for the Mustang mare. So let's start with the grooming kit. I might not be able to show everything, so I'll just lay it down on the table and I'll show you. But I, we have this grooming kit. We have tons of brushes. I wasn't expecting this much. And then there's like some hoof picks over here. They're so cute, they're colorful. And then there's also a little sponge. Okay, so the thing I'm just gonna show you and then I'll just lay it down on the table. The last thing I'm just gonna show you right now is this very cute bucket. Right, I forgot she made me another blue bucket, but um, I don't have it here. She made me some apples and some carrots. I'll actually bring it right now. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. So guys, this is the bucket. So this is another bucket that she made. This is the second one. And she has these two carrots she made. It's super cute. Let's put it back in. And she also made this cat out of clay. And yes, she likes cats again. This is a silver bingo cat. These are domesticated cats, so yeah, they're not leopards or anything. And this is so cute, and it has a little baby over here. So it's adorable. It's on the front door of my barn. So yeah, and I'm just going to lay these down on the table, and I'm just going to put some uh, tack on Bella so you guys can see how it looks like. Okay, so I put some accessories on um, Bella, and she's looking adorable. So let's start with the boots first. Um, I don't know what to say. They're adorable. I'm just going to fix them. Okay. So they're so cute. She made like a blank matching stable set, probably. And now to the blanket. <laughs> adorable. So you can see she made like a little pattern over here and everything and then she made this fly mask i don't know why i didn't put the halter on instead of the well i i don't know why i put the fly mask on instead of the halter but yeah the fly mask is super cute like it's one of my favorites i love the little string shot string 
no chin strap she made <laughs> sorry guys so um yeah it's i don't really make um fly masks with chin straps so that was a little bit um different i liked it i like it so yeah um it's very cute and i'm gonna lay the other stuff on the table i'll just um do an overview of what other stuff she made so these are all the polo wraps and then going here we have the bridle so um paper back pad um laundry line or well, lunging set and then saddle and saddle pad then here we have a turquoise halter and um a little you know turquoise um lead rope they're so very cute then of course we have other stuff over here like i showed you before and of course buckets and stuff i already showed you that but yeah this is um all she made me and again thank you so much chloe um i, I love it so yeah thanks so much this is uh, a beauty. This is my parents' present, and oh my god, so adorable. <laughs> she is the Hanoverian mare, and uh, I don't know what to say about her right now. I, I love everything about her. She does dressage, and of course, her name is White. So I... <laughs> <laughs> it's the opposite of her coat color and it just makes it very unique and that's why I named it white and um, maybe in my series you might see like white blankets, white halters, everything white because her name is white and you know it pops up like bright on her because she's black so yeah she's very unique I love her so much um yeah so very cute <laughs> wow <laughs> this cool dude is here so this is super cute well cool and cute and yeah he's a pinto stallion he's very cute very cool sorry very cool <laughs> i'm so um used to saying cute instead of cool so he's very cool and um i love his spots like you know his um, shapes white and orangey um brown or something like that and i the thing i really love about him is his eyes are like so blue i like it and then this little paint that's splattered on his muzzle or some like on his nose it, it makes him unique because not all of him have this i don't think so but i don't know if the whoever made him did that little paint there on purpose or on accident, but I sure do like it. It makes him unique, so yeah. And yeah, his name is Wind Dancer, so he's very cool. Yeah, and yeah, now I'm gonna show you a big present I got. It is the barn. So I wanted this. I really wanted this, and you can see Flames is in that stall. You might not see it. Say hi to the camera, Flames. She really can't see it right now. Anyway, yeah, it's a little bit dusty, so, yeah. And, oh, I don't know where to start from. So, this is the barn. And, of course, she likes our stable. So, this is Princess's stall, and I'm going to bring her and show. She came with the barn, and, yeah, there's... <laughs> Lizzie over here, she's the rider that came with the barn. And the thing I most like is this flower pot. I have two. And they can like get off the windows and stuff. Of course this pitchfork, I love it so much. And I don't know why, but it's just cute. And here are some bridles, saddles, more saddles over here. And um, yeah, blankets. This blanket came with the stable, and of course this halter. And over here in this paddock, we have Sparks and Crystal. And over there we have the other barn, which is a little bit bad. Anyway, and then 
like that. We have lots of halters over here. They're very cute. Then White's halter and um, Chica's halter. Chica's right here. Say hi to the camera. Oh, she's camera shy, isn't she? And then over here is Fire... Wait, no. Mystery. So, Mystery is the Arabian Full. I, th I believe it's Arabian Colt. And I made this blanket for him. And he's super cute. His mom, I'm going to show you her in a second. And yeah, this is the uh, barn I got. And he's super cute. I'm going to show you uh, the horse that also comes with it. So, it is Princess. Say hi to the camera. So, she's the saucy queen. So, yeah. We really don't know if Blossom and Princess are going to be friends. So, this stay tuned for that. Because uh, things are going to get weird. And, um, <laughs> she's, like, the horse I wanted for months. <laughs> and... Um, yeah, she's princess, and she's the Arabian mare. <laughs> so cute. And, of course, Lizzie rides her. But Lizzie also wants white. But, yeah, I'm not going to spoil anything because in my series I will say that. Anyway, yeah, I'm just going to put her in the pasture or paddock. Don't really know the difference. <laughs> but, um, yeah, this is the barn. And I'm just going to go get Blossom. <laughs> And, yeah. Okay. Uh, Blossom. She's super jealous of every mare and every horse in the stable. So if you watched my the Celia moving to the new stable, season one, episode four, uh, well, Blossom was a bit jealous of there. And so, I don't know if they're going to be best friends or not, but you'll just be stay stay tuned for that and yeah they're both grays i love gray horses so i have a few grays because i like them and yeah so thank you for you guys all watching this video and i'm just gonna do like an overview of the barn so that's what i'm gonna do